guys, what is up? Charlie Pangus here. I have another tutorial for you guys today. I'm gonna show you how to make epic bad shapes effortlessly using Illustrator CC, the latest version. So I have a couple tools that I like to use in Illustrator to make any shape. It just makes the job so much easier. So I'm gonna show you guys those tools today. So hopefully you guys find this video really helpful. And if you do, be sure to leave a thumbs up, uh, subscribe if you haven't already. And um, without further ado, let's go and begin. What I like to do for the first method is go to my rectangle tool and I draw out a long rectangle about right there and um, what's gonna be interesting about this is you're gonna see these little dots on each corner they're gonna be tiny little white dots with a solid dot in the center very very small if I zoom in you guys will be able to see what I'm talking about and I think I will zoom in that way you guys can actually see it so if I zoom in you can see on the left corner that I selected there's a little tiny dot with a another circle around it that's basically um, a anchor point and what it allows you to do is it allows you to round corners so we're gonna use that today to create these bad shapes. So if I take that corner and drag to the right, you can see that it rounds it and that's exactly what we wanted to do. So now what I would like to do is just go to the bottom left and right dots. We're just gonna select the bottom two and then uh, drag up. And as you guys can see, we already have a bad shape going. It's really as simple as that. So that's kind of what I like to do for the first method. And then from here, we can even alter it a little bit more. Like for instance, if I wanted the top to be a little bit, um, you know, arced or whatever, I can create another shape over that and basically select both of them, center it, and then I can go to my Pathfinder and divide them, and then I could just delete the top two, and then what we're left with is just this smiley face looking badge shape. So as you guys can see, it really doesn't take any effort at all to do this. So that was basically one method. Um, we used just the round corner anchor points to create a badge shape, uh, but you might want a different look than just the rounded look. So I'm gonna show you guys how to do that real quick. The first thing I wanna do is do Command R and um, drag out a line so we can actually use that line to create half of a shape and then I'm going to show you guys how to duplicate it and flip it really easy so we're going to start from the top we're going to go about right here right here and we're going to end it with a really sharp point and then we're going to close it off right there so now we have a half of a shape um, but we need the full shape obviously it looks a little weird right now so what I like to do is I like to go to my reflect tool or you can hit O on the keyboard and then I like to go to the top point and then I like to hold an option but what I want to do is zoom in so you guys can see the details. So now that I'm zoomed in I'm going to select the shape, I'm going to go to that reflect tool, and I'm going to go to the very top point, hold an option, uh, click once on my mouse and then what I want to do is uh, do a vertical copy of it so I'm having preview checked just so I can see what it's going to look like as the end result and then I'm going to click copy because I'm happy with that. So now we have two halves so we have a full now and um, let me hide this line real quick because we don't want that and as you guys can see we have a full shape now that's exactly what we wanted and from here what we can do is we can merge it together and we can even resize it do anything we really want to it and um, I don't really like how this is looking so I'm gonna go to the uh, you know middle left and right points and just gonna round those real quick and as you guys can see we have this nice bad shape going now so that's just another way to create a bad shape you can go crazy with this so I mean you can add a circle to it on top you know to create another look so if we actually center both of those, we're gonna merge them together. And uh, as you guys can see, I'm using the rounded corner tool a lot. I love those anchor points because they just make the job so much easier. Um, and I'm gonna round that. So now we have an even cooler bad shape. It kind of looks like a shield from a knight or something like that. So anyway, that is how I make bad shapes. It's really, really simple. So we're using the reflect tool. We're using those rounded anchor points. And we're basically just using the pen tool with a solid black fill to create our shapes and then from here we can add strokes around it we can you know take the solid fill out and make it a stroke instead there's so much stuff we could do anyway that is how you guys can make epic bad shapes in illustrator the latest version um, it's awesome you guys should definitely check it out anyway if you enjoyed this video today please be sure to leave a like subscribe if you haven't already guys i'm charlie pangas i'll see you in the next one peace